I don't really want to feel like a stuffed sausage. <laughs> I would like this to be like really, really firm. <laughs> like trying to push your fat in. Every woman wants to look stunning on her wedding day. Now, help is on the way for Bulging Brides. Just take a big breath in. Oh. Maybe it's the wrong size. Are you sure it's your dress? Meet Season. Her dress fit when she bought it. Now she can barely squeeze into it. Oh, honey, it won't do up. Today's weather report, season soft, flabby, hell, she's skinny fat. Um, so sorry. Are you sure it's your dress? Try this. <laughs> oh. Tommy Hi. Europe, Hi. personal trainer. What's going on here? It's not fitting right now. I need to be fitting into my dress. Uh, it took me a lot longer than six weeks to get this size, so I don't know how I'm going to get it all off in six weeks. You want to walk down the aisle like that? No, I don't. That's your food diary. Okay. Write down everything you eat, and this is your new workout gear. These better be loose by the end of six weeks. I'm hoping I can negotiate a bit with him. Uh, maybe he'll say 10 minutes of exercise, I'll say five, and hopefully settle on, say, seven. I'm gonna do everything I can to get the best results with the least amount of work. Three, <laughs> two more. You wanna fit in that dress, you're gonna have to work for it. Season's a real estate agent who wants a body makeover before she ties the knot. I'm gonna be sick. That's okay, but that'll mean working hard and giving up deep fried food for six weeks, because I won't negotiate. If that was your all, you're in trouble. So, did you get that list I gave you of all the things to do? I have, I have. And, and have you um, done any of them? Not really, not yet. Well, Chris has really been knocking himself out with the wedding planning. <laughs> he's He must be exhausted, because he's done <laughs> absolutely nothing. No. I, I, hey, I get involved now and again. I took our priest out for golf. Like, the jobs I gave you are very important. You know that, right? Yeah. The good thing is that I would rather just do it on my own, because I, that way it's going to be done right. Do you want one of these prawn dumplings? We love going out and having drinks and, and nice food, and, and I'd say that's where we really connect. I mean, you know, it's through food and, and drink. I love you. I have an obsession with deep fried food. I love dim sum, french fries, cheese sticks, chicken wings, pretty much everything deep fried. Could I also please have a sweet and sour sauce? By having two of my favorite fast food restaurants right beside each other, I'm able to create the perfect menu plan for myself. One restaurant has the cheese sticks that I love and the fries and gravy. The other restaurant has the sandwich that I like, the chicken sandwich. Well, the biggest problem with my dress is the fact that it doesn't fit me perfectly. It's really quite apparent right through here. So I'm very stressed out about it. Um, I need to have that dress looking perfect. I'm Tommy Europe, personal trainer. This is my partner, nutrition coach Nadine Bowman. We're on a mission to help brides look great on their big day. Season, welcome to your Isle of Shame. Looks good. Yeah. Let's deal with our first platter. Breakfast bonanza. Ah! You like breakfast, don't you? I love breakfast. This is one week of your breakfast. 7,800 calories. Okay. Just in breakfast. White tortilla shell with butter, bacon, pancakes, lemonade, burger and fries. <laughs> I slept in that day. My all-time favorite, eggs cooked in bacon fat. That's the best way to cook them. Well, this one week alone would put on two pounds of fat. <laughs> Can you burn off two pounds of fat in a week? Not the way I'm going. No, not at all. Now come with me. Oh. You like that, huh? I call this platter hitting the sauce. Your sauce is alone, 2,800 calories. Okay, that's a lot. Put that over a year, 146,000 calories. How much weight have you put on in the last couple of years? Uh, probably 20 pounds. Well, if you were to drink like this every week, yeah. 44 pounds. Oh my gosh. I guess I shouldn't be so saucy. Ding, 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 ding. Come on. This last platter, I like to call battered and bad. This is one month of your battered badness. <laughs> Fries, yes. Deep fried sushi, yes. That looks gross. You wrote the food diary. I do like those. Every hot wing that you eat, 111 calories. <laughs> I never realized there are over 100 calories per wing. Put your hands out to the side and close your eyes. On each of your wings, <laughs> 18 is... pounds of fat. <laughs> you like that look? It's gonna look great in that wedding dress. Let's <laughs> ditch this fat and let's go measure yours. Individually, everything looks good, but when it's piled up on a platter, it's not so much. 
Season? Yes. Time for the shape analysis, right now. Bust, 35 inches. It's bigger than I thought it was. Waist, 32 inches. I'd like it to be under 30. Hips, 40 inches. <laughs> That's a doozy. Let's get you up on the scale. Weight, 100. 43 pounds. It's definitely higher than I thought it was going to be. You're five foot four. We're a dress size of eight. 143 pounds. Body type, pear shape. I don't even like pears. I'm not too concerned about the weight at all. It's going to be the inches and toning. Let's go see how you look in that dress now. Hello, Jean. This is our new bride season. Hi, Jean. Let's get you into your dress. Nice with you. I think this might actually, oh. <laughs> no. Maybe this won't actually do up. Let's do the sash up here. And I don't really love the way the sash is looking right now. I could think of some other ideas if you like. That'd be great. Jean, tell us what's wrong with the dress. Well, Tommy, the big problem here is that the zipper won't go up. It actually can go up on the hook and eye, but the problem is all in the rib cage and in the waist. In the fronts, it's a smooth line from the top of the bodice to the hips. Very, very, very snug, so there's nowhere to hide. Did that dress fit at one time? I did order it the right size. We need to lose some inches from your waist and your hips. Mm -hmm. We need to tone up these arms, lady. Oh yeah, they're gonna be on display. <laughs> We're gonna have to tone up through your back, make okay. sure it's completely smooth, otherwise you will get back ass. The only way it's gonna happen is if you stick to your nutrition plan and stick to your fitness plan. 100%. I'll be working out and eating healthy. We've got six weeks to tone up Season's arms and midsection. Well, I feel a little dejected in the fact that um, everything that I already knew was a bit of an issue on my body was pointed out. Season, welcome to Tommy's Playground. This will be your physical assessment. Time to dirty up that manicure. Come on. All right, Season, time to get over the honeymoon. Shuffle, down in a squat position, down in a squat position. Feet do not come together. She's lazy. Jump, good. If you want to fit in that dress, you're going to have to work for it. Tommy doesn't understand how I feel. She likes the good life. I'm more of like a luxury vehicle. Come on, princess, let's go. <laughs> doesn't want to work hard for it. Jump, run back to the start, run back to the start. If she wants to do what she's doing right now, she can get ready to roll down that aisle. Don't let your feet touch the ground. <laughs> Bring them up. Come on. I think Season was worried about breaking a sweat and uh, she didn't even come close. I'm gonna be sick. That's okay. Tommy's a drill sergeant. It's better not break a nail. Use your hips, use your hips, use your hips. Faster. Come on, let's go, Whoa. come on, Season, let's go. Sometime over this next six weeks, you are gonna have to push yourself. Two, and one. So today, Tommy's playground, failure. If that was your all, you're in trouble. Well, you know, Tommy doesn't understand how I feel, so he was like, oh yeah, I just keep going, it's no problem. Next, Season falls back on her old ways. I said I wouldn't drink. I lied. Better not break a nail. Season is trying to spring into a healthy new lifestyle and slim down enough to look fabulous in her wedding dress. Did that dress fit at one time? I did order it the right size. Hello, Season. Hi, Tommy. So you have a big love for fried foods? It's huge. Dips? Yes. Booze? A little bit. Dim sum? A lot. And extremely inactive? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> you stay on that course, this is what's gonna happen. <laughs> wow, I would skip a few sauces to avoid looking like that. Well, if you put your words into action, follow your fitness plan, follow your meal plan, you could look like this. Oh, that looks good. You know you're going to have to work really hard, right? Yeah, I do. Good. Tis the season of change. Let's go. Foot's on top of the bosu. Okay. Keep your heel close to the middle. You're going to touch down lightly. Side, back, other side. Season's fitness plan is going to be filled with core exercises. She's very soft, very deconditioned, but she sounds very determined. How are the legs feeling? Burning. Good. I have a lot of balance-related exercises for season. Drop your hips, raise your hips, leg raise. Jesus. Just really that tack her glute medius, main stabilizing muscle through her leg. I just want to lay on it like it's a little pillow. Up, let's go, let's go, season. 
Susan has soft arms. Her wedding dress definitely exposes her upper chest, shoulders, and arms, so they definitely need some toning. Think of that wedding dress. I know, I know. I'll probably work out more in the next six weeks, working out six times per week, than I will have in the whole rest of my life put together. How do those feel? Painful. Season, this is a day in the life of your new food plan. Let's get started. All right. Breakfast, you have your smoothie. Yogurt, strawberries, bananas. For your snack, cup of grapes, half a cup of cottage cheese. Looks disgusting. Lunch, half a pita with turkey and sprouts. And what about some sort of sauce or dip? Snack, protein bar. Chocolate and peanut butter, it's almost like a peanut butter cup. Dinner, you have your dim sum and you have your vegetables, except no skin. Along with that, throughout the day, eight cups of water. Do you think you're gonna like all the food? I think I will, eventually. I don't think you'll even know the difference. This is the Tommy taste test. There better not be anything gross. You're gonna try two different dips, and you let me know which one you like the best. The purpose of the taste test is to prove to Season that low-fat food options can be just as tasty as full-fat food options. First one was better. There really wasn't that much of a difference in taste. I would be quite happy eating the other ones. Now you have a steakette coming up. Yeah, and you're welcome to come. There's not a chance that I'm sticking to the meal plan on my stay yet. You can do it my way and walk down the aisle with a big smile on your face, or you can do it your way and roll down the aisle. The choice is yours. Tommy, sorry you can't be here. I would have loved to have had you for entertainment. Uh, topless dancers are my favorite. You guys have a good time at the Staggate last night? We had a great time. Yeah, yeah. fun. Yeah, it was good. Today's gonna be your payback. Everybody gets one of these. It's your fault too though, you guys brought me out. Now take a deep breath in, try to hold on to your cookies. This is cardio tennis. This is not gonna be easy. You deserve a payback. You guys are all accomplices. Ladies, I see you have your rackets. I hope you like cardio. Work it, come on, push it, push it. I knew right from day one, she was definitely gonna cheat. So today was her payback. Try to get to every ball on one bounce. Just try and make it over the net. I'm never drinking with you again. <laughs> Cardio tennis, very, very strenuous. You have a lot of fun, but you're moving around a lot, burning a lot of calories. Are you gonna do anything productive, Tommy, or are you just gonna watch? I fit into all my clothes. How about you? Uh... All of them burned a lot of calories, which they needed to do, because they drank a lot of calories last night. There is no more cheating season. Are you guys gonna help her out for the next little bit? Yeah. I'm not eating or drinking with her ever. <laughs> they knew better. They knew I should have eaten that stuff and they were right there with me. So I'm glad that they got to suffer a little bit too. We're trying to get season into that wedding dress, okay? Those yeah. calories from drinking and the shots and everything, don't need them. Never again. Save them for your wedding night, all right? Well, I just feel a lot of heat from you right now and it's very stressful. Next, wedding season is getting to Chris. When I get around to it, I'll get around no, to it. Chris. Bride to be season is having a tough time adjusting to a healthier lifestyle. I'm hungry. When I'm hungry, I'm unhappy. And when I'm unhappy and I eat vegetables, it doesn't help. Hello, season. Hi, Tommy. Three week weigh in today. Bust. 34 inches. You're down one inch. Awesome. Waist. 31 inches. Down one inch. That's good. Hips, 39 inches. You were down one inch. Yes. So 34, 31, 39, three inches. That sounds much cuter. I'm, I'm all in the 30s now. That's good. I right, get up on the scale. Weight, 138 pounds. You're down oh five God. pounds. That's awesome. Five pounds, three inches. It's amazing the results you can get in three weeks. I had no idea I could do this. So the next three weeks are gonna be even tougher. It's gonna okay. be extra hard on you. You must stick to your meal plan. And because of your results, you get a bonus. Really? I'm sending you off to see Jean. You want something for your dress? I wasn't happy with my bow, so I was hoping to maybe change the, the 
band of it. Okay, I'll let you and Jean work that out. That's amazing. And I know you like the idea of having something at the waist, but you're not crazy about this one, right? Yeah, this just looks too difficult. It looks like I'm gonna have to fiddle with it all night. So I suggest she come by my studio, show her maybe three ideas, and hopefully we walk away with one that she likes. Okay. We've got jewels right in the middle of your body, so it draws your eye to the center of your body. Okay. It's a nice thin belt, and then you tie it at the back. Okay. I want something that just has a little bit more oomph to it. I know that you're using sort of an eggplant color for your bridal party, and I know this doesn't match, but this is just sort of the idea here. So it'll give the illusion of a smaller waistline. And it definitely would make my waist look smaller. I'm just not a big fan of incorporating the bridesmaid's colors into my dress. I love the design of this buckle. I do too. The width of this belt works really well for your body shape. Okay. Draws eyes towards the center of your body, lengthens your body. I like that. Yeah. It's all sounding good, Jean. I think it would definitely make my waist look smaller. I like the bling on it. I would like to have it in the same color as the dress so that the only thing that stands out is the buckle. It's nice to have so many good options. It's, it just makes it harder, though. I'm not going to fault you, but just don't say that I haven't been helpful, because I have been helpful. I'm so stressed out right now. I have the longest list of things to do. Why is it fair that this is my list of things to do, and that's yours? Well, I just I'm feeling a lot of heat from you right now, and it's very stressful. Me looking at all this stuff stresses me out. I'm also working out every day, not eating all the foods I like, and I have all this pressure to lose weight. But you panicking does not help the situation. It okay, well, doesn't make it go anywhere. You know what's going to help the situation? You help it, okay? So if I can count on that, I need that. Okay, I need that right now, Chris. Now for the important part. Next, does Season get the perfect results she's hoping for? Wait! Season is a real estate agent hoping to trim the fat from her bottom line and fit into her wedding dress. Everybody told me that I get used to eating like this and that I'd like it. It's not true. Season, Chris, welcome to your partner challenge. Today, we're going to see how well you two work together. And you'll get a glimpse of how far Season has come. It's a two-part challenge. First part, we're going to be in a boat. Second part, it's going to be a run. Reach and pull. Reach and pull. Good. Started off with a rowboat. Well, they were rowing. That's <laughs> And go. We're heading that way. We're going to the beach, to the beach, to the beach. A couple hard ones, Chris. All right, come on, take us home, take us home, take us home. Let's go, you two. Let's go. We went all the way across the lake, got out, then it was on to the foot. Showtime, let's go. You're way too far ahead. Come on, you two. Yeah. We got one last big hill, let's do it. You want to beat the man? Come on, season. What you got? What you got? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yay! Kiss me, you fool. Thank you. You've completed your partner challenge. The row was for your core and these arms. Oh, and they are better. getting better. Yeah, they're getting tinier. I think it was awesome. I'm so proud of her. What, where she's come from and where she's at today and how fit she is. I mean, look at her. I love she her. looks great. So we got a final dress fitting coming up. I'm, uh, I'm a little nervous about it just because it was so far from fitting before, but I think I've come a long way. Like everything else is fitting better, so I assume that has to. So let's take a look at our route. Yeah. Started over there. Hello, Season. Hey, Tommy. Stand right here. Bust, 33 inches. You're down two inches from the start. Yes. Waist. 30 inches. You're down two inches from the start. I love it. Hips, 38 inches. Again, down two inches from the start. That's reasonable, that's pretty good. You're in the 30s, you've lost six inches. Let's get you up on the scale. Weight, 132 pounds. Yeah, Season. Boy. You're down 11 pounds. Oh my god, that's incredible. 11 pounds. 11 pounds, 6 inches. Oh, that's huge. Nice work. Thank you very much. Now it's time for the ultimate test. The dress. OK, season, we're going to zip up. Are you nervous? A little bit, yeah. Well, I can already see there's going to be no problem. Oh, yeah. wow. That was quick and easy. How's season doing in there, Jean? Uh, one more second, Tommy. I invited season's mom to be the first to see her in the dress. OK, here we come. Oh, oh, so beautiful. It's exciting, hey? 
You look fabulous. I love you. Thank Congratulations. you for the Season is down six inches, 11 pounds. Lots of changes with the dress. Jean, tell us about it. Well, certainly lots has gone on here. There's no overhang in the top. With this new belt, we can really see how tiny her waist is now. In the back, it was a real struggle with the zipper, and now the zipper has gone up with no problem at all. The placket is laying nice and flat, so we can see all these beautiful crystal beads going all the way down to the hem of her dress. Congratulations. Thank good you, work. Jean. I haven't felt this good about my body in a long time, and I want to keep it this way. She has every reason to feel confident walking down that aisle with a big smile on her face. When she came out of that wedding dress, I mean, it looked beautiful. Uh, it really did. And I hope her and Chris have a great wedding and uh, make health and fitness part of their lifestyle. Season was resistant at first, but in the end, she lost 11 pounds and six inches. Her dress fits perfectly, and she's all ready to glide down that aisle. My wedding day is gonna be perfect now that I can fit into the dress. This was the final missing piece that I've been stressing out about. I think Chris is gonna be pretty happy when he sees me walk down the aisle. I really like the way this feels. I wanna keep it up.